Romelu Lukaku's poor work rate is contributing to his struggles in a Chelsea shirt this season, according to new analysis. Lukaku has lost his place in Thomas Tuchel's side to Kai Havertz in recent weeks and his £97.5 million move from Inter Milan last summer is yet to pay off for the Blues. The Belgian striker rejoined Chelsea from Inter for a club record fee at the start of the season amid hopes he could fire them to the Premier League title. But Lukaku has failed to repay Chelsea's faith in him, netting just 11 goals in 31 appearances across all competitions this season. He has been reduced to a bit part role off the bench in Chelsea's last two Premier League games, with Havertz leading the line and scoring in wins against Newcastle and Norwich. The German forward has scored six goals in his last seven appearances for the Blues and appears to have earned Tuchel's trust up front. Lukaku made headlines earlier this season by publicly bemoaning Chelsea's tactical system, claiming it doesn't suit his style of play in an interview with Italian media. His struggles have now been laid bare by a segment of analysis from Gary Neville on Sky Sports. Neville looked at the running statistics from two strikers from each of the big six Premier League clubs on Monday Night Football this week. The results were alarming for Chelsea fans, with Lukaku coming rock bottom when it comes to distance covered and sprints per 90 minutes. Unsurprisingly, Liverpool and Manchester City forwards scored well, with Roberto Firmino and Phil Foden topping the list alongside Havertz and Manchester United's Edinson Cavani. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang, who left Arsenal for Barcelona in January, and Cristiano Ronaldo, whose work rate has regularly been criticised at United, were alongside Lukaku at the bottom, prompting a theory from Neville, if you look at the bottom three. Aubameyang has been let go by Arsenal, he explained. The problems that Cristiano Ronaldo, if he's having at Manchester United, they're over the fact that when Manchester United play a big game, like Manchester City, the rumours were Ralph Rangnick had left him out because he doesn't pressurise enough, they can't press out of possession, and Romelu Lukaku is at the bottom. The days of the 8, 9 or 10 KMS as a striker are dead. You look at those Liverpool and Manchester City forwards, they're all mobile, all athletic. And it isn't just enough now to score goals. It sounds crazy but that is the truth. 